So we were toying around with the idea of doing a um, Destiny 2 mod spot um, with Green Stego, starring Green Stego. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you've had a chance to uh, pick out a random mod to talk about that you might like or not like. Kind of. For my inaugural debut Green Stego's mod spot, I was thinking about walking through um, the armor slots specifically with how they pertain to um, the weapon and like what different kind of mods you can slot into the helmet piece right. as opposed to the chest piece because they recently revamped it. You can take a look at the, um, the slide that is on the screen right there and uh, it used to have like enhanced sniper rifle targeting and they kind of did away with that and they consolidated things a little bit where there's just sniper rifle targeting um and they have that for like a bunch of them but oh that's right anyway. yes i remember that mm -hmm. uh there's there's like I, a, I i i'm uh -oh. actually really curious i was uh -oh. I'm, i've got my, i've got a pencil and blank paper like right next to me <laughs> i kind of want to know I'm taking notes. There we go. See? Yeah. So here we go. Green Stego's debut mod slot. Mod spot. <laughs> slot. Focusing spot. on <laughs> mod slots. <laughs> In the helmet. We're going to work our way down. Love it. In the helmet. Okay. And I'm, 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 there's like a bunch. There's a lot going on here. I'm just going to talk about the, the weapons because for each mm -hmm. Each slot there also is like an affinity mod that has to do with whether it's arc or solar or void and has to do with the abilities and has to do with sometimes getting super energy or cooldowns. We're not talking about those right now. We're going to hit those up another time. But you time. will, right? <laughs> I will. Because, what we're talking about because right that's now, one of the areas where I'm like completely oblivious. So yeah, Han, I'm Shaw, looking just, forward to that. Shaw but Han you're talking was useless about when it comes to this, so. Yeah, you're talking may... about generalized, generalized stuff that can go into any affinity, regardless of whether it's solar void or arc. Yes, I am. And these, these are going to be like Good with a know. focus on the weapon. So in the helmet, okay. weapon helmet, mods. Yep. Um, you got your head in there. This is where you are taking in information. These mods help you look. So there are two kinds of mods that go in the helmet mod slot you got your ammo scavenger not ammo scavenger ammo finder perks right that has to okay. do with sight yeah i get it because that's because you're looking for your ammo and also the oh, targeting you're, lo you're looking for the ammo on the ground that makes sense and yep. targeting is obvious and, yeah and the targeting is pretty obvious right. um i basically change out those two based on whether i'm in pve or pvp if I'm in a PvE situation, I put on the ammo finder perks so that I can keep my shotgun or the ammo common for my heavy and special. Um, right. But I like to have like the the targeting when I'm in PvP, and that's the helmet. Right, which makes sense, right? Because it's like the you're less likely to run out of ammo in a in a PvP match, right? The ammo just drops if you kill somebody. The special one. It anyway. also makes sense because it's the helmet and it helps with your finder or your targeting, which both have to do with like looking. Vision. Yeah. Look through your helmet looking. visor. Vision. Looking. That's a good way to sighted guardians. So so keep in mind looking, right. Looking. Yeah. Right. I like it. And targeting I like in it. the helmet. Mm hmm Now Finder and targeting. Got it. Moving down. Arms. Sally Bug, what do you use your arms for in uh, in Destiny and in in as it pertains Holding to your Holding my weapon. Yes. So, basically, you got two things that your uh, arms do. Either the ammo, the reloaders, okay. or yeah. the swapping. So, like, 
Um, okay. It'd be like shotgun dexterity, so that if you want to have it be where you can swap over to your shotgun right quick, bring that up, then that's going to be in your So arm. the dex hit, that, that's actually good to know, because that's what, I, like, I kind of usually just gloss over the dexterity ones, because I didn't know exactly what that meant. And now, now I kind of get it. Does that so essentially add quick draw and again, to your weapon, right? Basically, yeah. So dexterity is more again a more of a PvP type of of um, mod because if you have someone rushing at you and you want to kind of like feel like you can compete against them, if you could quick swap to your special weapon and yeah. Shoot them in the or face faster. If you're using like a grenade launcher thing. hand cannon combo, you're going to want to be able to switch back and forth. Yeah, if you've got like a fusion switch rifle back in your back faster. pocket that you want to swap to right quick before they get into shotgun distance range, now, maybe you want to Now, let me. No, and reloader makes sense, right? You just reload that weapon faster. Let me ask you this. Mm -hmm. If you have on the dexterity, so using Romance Girls. Um, what what she was talking about uh say you have a hand cannon and a grenade launcher would you want to have a hand cannon dexterity and grenade launcher dexterity both socketed for the best option there or which one's better yeah. to have if you you're have swapping back and forth it might be that you're in a situation if where if i'm taking if i'm doing a grenade launcher and cleaning up with my hand cannon I only need to switch to my hand cannon fast because my grenade launcher, I'm going to need to reload anyway. And I don't need, that's not going to be for quick situation. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Okay. Yep, it does. But a hand cannon, I'm, I'm uses a clean up, I'm going to need to switch to my hand cannon a lot quicker. Because I, I, I need yes, to. right. And you're going to, I get it. You're going to notice it more with um, your weapons that have lower handling. So it'll because it basically gotcha. brings so it's, up the it's kind of a waste. Like so, if you've got uh, if you have a wa a weapon that just naturally is weak in that area, these mods help kind of yes. get them back up to compete with others. Nice, I like it. Yeah. So if you had a quick draw weapon, you'd probably want to go for the reloader perk. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Right. Or if it just it has like like it's it's um. Like your has that perk where the handling is its masterwork. Yes, um, and also I'm going to go back a little bit. Um, the targeting mod found in the helmet yes. also kind of yes. gives a little bit of snapshot sights. It increases aim down sights oh. speed. It's not quite as strong as having that actual perk snapshot sights. But it and does. That's a good point. Speed. Yeah, yeah, it increases. It bumps target acquisition um, slightly. The auto aim slightly. Um, it, but also the aim down sight speed, which is technically handling. Yeah, handling is is bumped into that. Okay. All right. Moving down to the chest piece. Again, you've got like a PVE focused role. This is where you've got your ammo reserves. Where if you right, because it's what what you hold on your body, right? Mm -hmm. It's where you stow your weapon. It's where you stow your ammo, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. your extra stuff. So that's um, scavenger. You said reserves. 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 Just reserves. Got it. As well as unflinching. So if you've got like mm -hmm. unflinching scout rifle aim. So the chest keeps you steady. Chest keeps you steady. Chest You're taking those bullets steady. right in the uh, chest. Oh, right. It, and normally that would cause you a lot of flinch. Right. But you can Got change it. it so that it, in your chest piece, it doesn't do that. Nice. Liking it. The legs, continuing our move down, the legs are a little bit less crowded. This is where you have... Um, the scavenger perks. So you see the purple ammo brick on the ground. You're going to run over it to pick up the ammo. The scavenger perk helps you pick up more ammo. On your legs. Okay. 
What's the, what's more the ammo. sort of scavenger more ammo? The, In other words, when you pick up a brick, like so, say you pick up, like if I have, um, I have a shotgun whose magazine is like say fifteen. If I have the scavenger perk on, does that mean that I can hold more than fifteen on that shotgun? No, that's re- that's reserves. That's in your chest piece. The oh, okay. So what does scavenger you, do? The scavenger is normally you put on your you got your shotgun more you ammo per brick. brick per brick. Yeah, exactly. You run over the per, the green brick and it says like plus three. You put As on shotgun like, scavenger and then it bumps that up to like plus four. Oh, okay. You put so you on two shotgun scavengers and it bumps it up to plus five. I'm trying nice. to imagine like how being. Uh, better on your feet could result in picking up more. You, you ammo. run over the ammo brick. Okay. You run over it. So if you enhance your leg armor, you're going to uh, be more effective picking up the armor when you run over it. Okay. Yeah. You put special ammo magnets. In okay. Your they're boots. magnets. Okay. That's what the armor magnets. See, Thank we, you. We should write the lore magnets. for this. The point, is, ammo the, point magnets. Is, the point is, I think of just like running over the, the ammo. So it's my legs. Gotcha. Nice. So it's your legs. Okay. okay. I like it. Wow, that is really well put, and and it Are makes it any, easier to remember where you need to go. And there's no for wh- weapon. What? There's no weapon mods for the class item. No, the class item is wow, where you're going to really see um, like finisher mods. <laughs> 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 the the unaf- I'm trying the to be un- thorough here. The, un- ele- the, the non-elemental ones, and we'll, we'll get into the elemental ones, like Solar Arc and, and Void. Oh, I can't wait. I'm so glad uh, we, those, we added Those have this nothing spot. to do with weapons, right? They got a, rid of those the affinity have, yeah, for the, weapons mods. I mean, it's, you, can get, you can put on special ammo finisher, which uses right, like, like that, a quarter. Yeah, that, which is a whole nother, that's like a whole nother realm realm of yeah we'll do that another week right we'll do that another week yeah, yeah we, is, we, this has been great we we need to just divide this up over the summer right we i'm gonna be like fully mod knowledgeable yeah, by the end of Sally the doesn't summer use thanks mods to green because Stego. she doesn't know anything about them until I don't now mods because i'm too good <laughs> yeah, so your helmet your helmet helps you look your yep. helmet helps you look hel- yeah your arms help you uh Handle your gun. Yep. Your, your chest, chest piece is where your um, storage provides either like armor, storage, or storage. And steady. Yep. Storage and steady. Storage and, and center legs, of gravity. And your legs is where you're running over the ammo bricks. That one is a huge ammo benefit bias. in PvP because, um, like, if you're using a shotgun in PvP, which, like, let's be honest, all of us have tried at least once. Right. If you pick up a green ammo brick, that's one shotgun shell. But if you've got shotgun scavenger, that's two. If you double dip on shotgun scavenger, then you pick up three shotgun shells oh, for every God. green. Uh, they brick. need to limit special ammo. They in, should make it so it doesn't stack. in PvP. Yeah, they should. Yeah, it shouldn't stack. I agree with that. So. Okay. Yeah. And that's it well, for Green Stego's I, uh, Mod Spot. Mod Spot. Thank you so much, I'm Green Stego. It. Absolutely amazing. I've, I'm looking at mods. I, I want to go play now and put some mods on. <laughs> that's really... All right. I'll, I'll see you guys later. <laughs> see you later. Can you finish <laughs> off the show? I'll just leave it here. Um, 